Meet Beth. 23. Excellent dresser. She reeks style. Weekends. Beth gets cheeky. She necks WKD recklessly. She never expected the sheer hell reserved when she entered the fence. 10.20. Beth left Ely. Sped her VW Beetle west. Swerved, screeched her steed, beep beeped the steer wheel. Her geezer, Stephen, peers meekly. He resembles Lenny Henry, except he's weedy. Sheep pressed between Spencer's vest. Beth yells, we'll see the fens, then get wet. Stephen remembers the decree. Keen, he enters the beetle. Delves gently, seeks the belt. Beth revs, they cheer, then speed freely. When they enter the fens, green, fresh smells meet Beth's senses. Creeks, trees, weeds, levees greet them sweetly. Speechless, they creep. The elements stem themselves, bend themselves everywhere they step, except every step gets deeper. Denser, the empty greenery seems endless. Stephen feels creeped. He pretends the scheme's serene, yet secretly every tree leers. Endless, eyeless, the enemy peers. Stephen's nerves melt, jelly blended. He regrets he needs the strength, the steel we reserve when we remember Pele. Then, when the deep sky speckles, Beth preps her reedy bed. Stephen shelters level, edgy sleeve tenderly pets Beth's flesh well. Beth's eyes needle when she sees the tent he's erected. Leary breed needs rejected, Stephen sleeps neglected. Then, sleep spent. They peel themselves free. They creep. Trees bleed. Scenery ferments. Beth tells herself they'll never flee the fence. Except, ten weeks spent, Beth emerges. Enters the next settlement. She teeters. Her energy levels receded. Her dress shredded. Feet wet. Perm demented. Except, she's free. Yet where's Stephen? Well, let's expel the mystery. Heed Beth's well-fed belches. Her greedy belly swelled. She fended when needs expected. When she felt empty, her Stephen merely resembled beefy, yet nerdy entree. The end.